Thanks. Perfect. So, so that's it. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. And... We've got about four minutes for questions. So if anyone wants to show up and uh, ask a question. Perfect. Interesting things there, I think, from everyone. So we had uh, async saving design. We had macro dialogue questions. So we had uh, rendering wastage removal, uh, which is great. Uh, symphony uh, excitement around WAPI from Paul, uh, multi-page viewing, and uh, bisecting patches as well as a desktop design brim. So any questions? And then we can... Uh, I have some questions about the PDF editing. Uh, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, you. Okay. So um, I just want to be sure that I understood that. So this, uh, the PDF editing uh, is done by the draw component? Yes. Okay. So um, uh, at which level you can edit the PDF documents? I mean, uh, as far as I understood, um, uh, the pages of the PDF are loaded as images or something like that, or are rendered. So, or something like that, right? Who wants to go? <laughs> so, I think PDF is complicated. Ash, do you want to hang on? Or, or is uh, Gokai still with us? So, so, there's lots of answers, but, but you're muted, Ash. So, I'll Oh, I'm sorry. I was, I was saying, let me, let me take a stab and you can fill in the details. So, there are actually two modes to, um, to, to uh, viewing and editing PDFs. Initially, you get a, a um, fast and accurate rendering that is in the form of an image, um, and that is uh, very quick and very accurate. Um, and that is basically most um, of what you would need just to view the document. But if you need to edit, then you would need to convert it into text and objects and images and all the, um, you know, breakdown of all the, the necessary elements on the, um, you know, document level. And for that, it's obviously much more um, costly in terms of, you know, the conversion, the, the time you need to spend if it's a huge document. Um, but once you've done that, you should get um, completely editable elements, provided that the PDF itself uh, retains all of the original details, uh, including the text um, um, uh, characters, the Unicode, uh, you know, code points, the fonts, uh, the images, and so on. Some PDFs don't have that, and in that case, you can't really edit. It's just an image uh, embedded within the PDF. Um, obviously, you know, we, we, that's information lost. We can go back, um, but these are basically the, the two modes. So uh, I hope that gives some clarity. Yes, uh, yes, but uh, uh, you, you you say that it must be con converted first. So that conversion is done automatically, or uh, it, it must be done manually. It's different modes. It's, it's rendered to a bitmap for the PDF -EM mode that we ship with. So you'd see a bitmap per page, and the primary editing then is adding comments or overlays or, or drawing on it or this kind of thing. And so that's a very common use case that we ship and, and support. Yeah, the other use cases are more speculative, like the whole convert your PDF uh, into shapes and then edit it and then reassemble it. But uh, Quickie, Quickie is an expert here, actually. So, uh, Quickie, do you want to give a better answer? I just saw the man. How much? We wrote a great chunk of this, I think. But, uh, no, he didn't hear anything we said. So, <laughs> Quickie yeah, can hear it. Okay. Maybe Henry. Henry wants to speak. Henry, speak. Tell us if you know the answer. But I think you're muted, Henry. Or you're, you're disconnected with the uh, headphones or audio uh, listening. So you, you, I think you need to reconnect and uh, connect your microphone. If you reload. In the meantime, while, while Henry reconnects um, <laughs> with the answer, uh, Lubosh, uh, when when we get all of your, your speed ups, are they all going to be in uh, shipping tomorrow? Or what, what's the story? Well, most of what I have, I have already pushed it to 2021. Not all of it. Uh, like, I have pushed most of the simple stuff, including the timer. Uh, what still can be done are improvements like. Uh, 
for example, uh, dropping the repeated cursor positions, or I, ha I have work in progress patch, which where the callback flush handler doesn't does a, uh, takes directly binary data and not strings. Uh, I f I could finish it, but that's still for, for now only local. Okay. So some of that goes into six four then, does it? The simpler stuff for the next release. Or? Uh, well, uh, at least the timer definitely can go to 6.4. Cool. For, for the rest, uh, I suppose some of the simpler stuff like the uh, rectangle co compression definitely. I'm not sure if, if all of it, like I it's suppose I, 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 I can put all of it, but uh, some of it could be more work. So Yeah, yeah. We, don't, we don't want lots of work and, and certainly we don't want risk in the state of God. Um, Henry, can you speak now? I still can't hear you, weirdly. You want to say something? I, I no. think he had clicked the uh, uh, raise the hand uh, by mistake. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> I, think, I think that's what he implied in the chat. Um, okay. Luke Walsh, I have a quick question. Is is uh, is some of what you've uh, improved in terms of performance um, also beneficial to the um, Collabora office? Um, or is it mostly or all completely specific to online? Uh, most of the work is for the callback flash handler, so it's online. But for example, the, 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 the rectangle handler in writer, I suppose it should improve writer slightly i'm not sure how much because because like if you work with writer it's just you so you don't don't get as many changes as if you have several other users who also also hit the same code so there may be some improvements for writer but i don't know if it will be noticeable thank you Cool. Uh, we should probably, if there are no more questions, rush on because I think we're already three minutes late for the next uh, the next person. Who is that? Ah, Pedro. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Are you able to get set up quickly? Uh, yes. Space, you yes. Know what to do. So, yes, I'm, uh, I'm that. ready to go, I guess. Is there <laughs> here, I okay. Aaron won't be presenting the next presentation, so we will uh, go straight after Pedro directly to to uh, let me check the schedule to Candy for easy acts to get involved. In. So let's start first with Pedro with user sentiment reporting. Yes, and please then bring Candy. Just warn him in the case he doesn't. Okay. Know. Yeah, and uh, my friends, you can kill your camera feeds, I guess. Anders. <laughs> it's okay, yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 